Welcome to Rockaway Street in beautiful the park section of Houghton. We're putting on the market this colonial home which is stately, beautiful yard, park-like setting and absolutely the most traditional home you're going to see in this section of town. Uh, what, walk with me for a minute and we're going to go up. So as you approach this house you're going to note that first of all it has a fairly maintenance-free outside. It also has one unique feature that still rides out to be one of the best in town. It has a upper roof that is still slate, and slate roofs are considered to be a hundred year roof. Uh, on top of that, character throughout, let's go take a look. Wow, look at this house. So we have a stately house in the park section of Booton. This home has four bedrooms, two and a half baths, absolutely incredible double-sided fireplace, a patio on the second floor, which overlooks the side yard. Uh, let's go in and take a look at this one. From the moment you walk into this foyer area, it says warm and inviting. We have a bench seat on each side of this foyer, which is great. We have French doors that open into the foyer area. And then when you come around to the foyer, you see how expansive it is. This is essentially where the heart of the home is. All of the rooms spider off of this. Um, let's go look at the living room here. You're going to note throughout the house that we have replacement windows throughout. And then in this large living room, hardwood floors, great shape, lots of trim work beautiful custom trim work in a traditional home. And then this is the coup d'etat. We have a double-sided fireplace. And on top of that, uh, the top part of the chimney has all been rebuilt with exceptional craftsmanship. This house has tradition, it has space, and everything that you want. All right, so we have this enclosed porch area, and above us is an outside porch area off the master bedroom. Can't wait to show that to you. In this porch area, we have the other side of the two-sided fireplace, beam ceilings with, with tongue and groove pine, great traditional room. This can be used as a rec room, playroom. It is absolutely open entertaining space for you in this very traditional home. So off of the main foyer is the dining room. And this dining room has chair rail, but the best part about it is this coffered ceiling. You can see the detail on the trim work. This is absolutely stunning. Uh, large dining room, easily can fit a table that accommodates 8 to 10. Big windows, bright, airy, uh, all updated, and hardwood floors again, right off of the kitchen. All right, so if you are a cook and you love to make things in the kitchen, this kitchen's for you. It has a mix of traditional and new. So as you can see, stainless steel appliances throughout. You can see a center island with five burners uh, on the island itself. It has a wine fridge built in right here dishwasher, refrigerator, and a wall oven, uh, kitchen aid appliances, gen air appliances, all great stuff. And then additionally, you have a small bar area where you can sit, have breakfast, and relax. Okay, so if you step down half a level here, you're on your way to the basement. In older traditional house in Bootin, many times the basement is a crazy, creepy place. Not this one, not at all. But let me show you one additional feature here. You have a half bath, so when you're entertaining guests, you can use this fully updated half bath and they don't have to go upstairs or downstairs to do so. Really great stuff. So follow me to the basement. All right, so here we are in a newly refinished basement. And when we're in this basement, the, most, the biggest thing you're gonna notice is there's no smell of must. And the reason why is they have done a drain around the entire house for waterproofing, uh, which has made it waterproof and also a radon mitigation system on the side of the home. Lastly, this was completely reconfigured so that it was more effective use of space. So what we have here is a washer dryer area and there's a sink in the corner. And then you have another entertaining area which wraps around here. This entertaining area, this could be used for a desk area, for a school area, now that we're all kind of working from home. And then you have storage uh, behind all of these different walls as well and utilities. Uh, excellently maintained home. All right, here we are in a fully updated bathroom. Lots of cabinet space on the walls, almost pantry-like. We have beautiful cabinets that match. We have Corian countertops, dual vanity sink. We have the, the toilet area and the shower area can be separated out with this pocket door. And then you have a fully updated shower area as well as a toilet area. So what a great place, um, all updated, ready to move in. Okay, bedroom number one, hardwood floors, traditional solid doors. We have trim work, as you can tell throughout large windows, vinyl replacements, fan light. It has a substantial closet uh, space. And then additionally, um, it has a view of the front of the home. Okay, bedroom number two. Bedroom number two here, as you come in, you're gonna notice 
across the front is cabinet space, which, is, which could also be used as a bench seat. You, you can't believe how much natural light is in this room. There's windows across the whole entire front bump out. And this is what we saw when we were in front of the home. And then, okay, so we have the solid doors, trim, all upgraded windows throughout. You notice overhead lights, which is an upgrade in the home of this, annu uh, this anniversary date. Um, also, closets, sitting area. Notice that there's two ways outdoors, which is incredible. And now I want to show you this outdoor space. You are going to be amazed by it. Come with me. So we have this outdoor space off the master bedroom. Terrific area to sit and have your morning coffee. So when you come out to this space, this is sitting over the family room that is downstairs. And then additionally, you have all this space available to you. And what's really neat is these parapets on the side are slightly higher. So you could sit here and absolutely have no interruptions from neighbors, no worries about visibility, and just relax, soak in the sun, and enjoy this beautiful park section house. So the icing on the cake on this home, it has another floor. Follow me. So back in 2005, I fell in love with this home and almost bought it myself. Now I have the privilege and pleasure to try to sell the home. And this was one of the areas that almost sold us on the home. So you have a skylight with natural lighting. You have this awesome room, which is a bonus room. But it's not just a finished attic for the point of putting up sheetrock. It actually is living space, livable, usable space. And there is space behind each of these walls that can store things. Lastly, it has another bath. So you not only have the ability to have a finished, a full finished bath up on this floor, this could be used as a master suite. Now you have to make some choices. Do you want the one with the porch outside or do you want the one that has this beautiful secluded area with its own restroom? So when I said park light property, I also want to tell you that this is pure entertaining, right? So we have this large deck outside, plenty of spaces you can tell, grilling area off to the side here. And let's take a walk up and take a look at this place. Here. So um, secluded side yards, lots of natural stone in the landscaping. We have uh, lots of space and as you can tell, uh, mature but young trees that are taken care of and that are also giving you that privacy in the backyard. So let's take another look up this, this path here. And we've got an area <clears throat> off to the right. The area off to the right, you can actually do some uh, fire pitting. And then up above, we have a playground area, and it has one of the coolest features you're ever going to see. So let's take a look at that. All right, so up on the playground area, we have a sitting area, we have a, a play set as well, and one of the coolest features you're ever going to see is a trampoline. So we have a trampoline in the middle of the yard at ground level. That is pretty awesome if you ask me. And it's in the ground, buried into the ground. So yeah, so there you go. That is awesome. In this backyard, we also have, it's hidden, a castle. And up on the castle, there's a deck area there, another great play area. And as we move around the yard, you'll see all these plantings. A chicken coop garden place. Literally, this is Bootin. Can you believe this, folks? And now, if you look down, you'll see you are in the prestigious park area of Bootin. Great house.